to Not Family Adventures. I hope you're all well. Hello to all the new subscribers out there. So today it's currently Friday and tomorrow we are going down to Devon. So at the minute I'm just trying to clean the house up. Um, basically a whole full clean today because it needs hoovering, polishing, the bathrooms need doing as well. I just absolutely hate cleaning the Northern State, but it's got to be done. And then I'm going to see if I can mow the lawn before it rains, hopefully as well. And if not, then it doesn't get done all week. Um, so we're going away for a week um, to Devon, a place called Insto. It's right by the beach. We're taking Holly as well, and she's not been for probably, I don't even know, like a year now. Or something like that. Um, so yeah, she'll probably love the beach again. Um, I will record the whole journey and stuff for you and maybe do like a little house tour where we're staying as well so you guys can see that um, and let you know the reviews on that as well. Um, but yeah, really looking forward to it. We've also got to pack all the bits up. Uh, we've ordered a Tesco order to come later on tomorrow once we get there so we didn't have to take all the fresh stuff down with us. It was just easier that way. Um, and then the food will last then anyway, the whole journey down. So yeah, we've got a Tesco order, just like your main fresh bits and bobs and like ice and stuff like that. Um, I'm going to take like some bits of alcohol down with us and um, toilet roll and bits and bobs like that. Because I'm not too sure what's there, to be honest with you. There's a washing machine and stuff, so I'll do the washing before I come back. So it saves me doing it um, when we do get back the week after. Um, but yeah, really looking forward to going down to Devon. We've not been for a while, like I said. Um, but yeah, I'll catch you guys in a bit. First things first, this floor needs a full on hoover because this one is currently molting like hell at the moment. Honestly, it's just, and this floor doesn't help, but look at it. Honestly, that was hoovered yesterday. So now look at it. Got anything to say for yourself? <laughs> <laughs> right we are all packed as you can see behind me a car full of stuff holly is just in the view over there you probably just about to see her head don't worry guys she's in safe <laughs> um so it's currently saying we'll we'll get there at 3 52 check-in is at four so obviously we've got to stop anyway between it um to let holly out and stuff for the toilet so we'll probably get there around after four at some point anyway um so it's yeah four hour journey just a short amount of time <laughs> um but yeah i'm staying down for a week it's just started raining typical british weather when you go on holidays it's just chucks it down pretty much every time for me we've had good times in Devon before yeah no last time we went Devon it was half sunny half Rain, like start of the week was rain and then the second week. good for week England. Oh well, yeah, but <laughs> <laughs> I just wanted one summer day. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'll pick you guys back up in a bit, probably when we're like halfway there, or when we stop off at the services. So the services we stopped at they've got like a dog walk area for doggies um which is quite good to do let them stretch their legs out a bit and us because my knees are really hurt and don't know about chris's <laughs> oh little leg bit huh she's not actually gone toilet yet either <laughs> too busy sniffing So I went for a McChicken sandwich meal, large fries, large coke. Chris went for... Steakhouse stack. Steakhouse stack? Never heard of that one. It's a special. Oh. Look at him taking that big bite. <laughs> 
Just watch her foot and the paw. Yeah, Because <laughs> that's where the thing looks. <laughs> You're doing this on purpose now. <laughs> Right, so we've just arrived at the Inglenook Cottage. It was a bit of a pain to find. Well, yeah, it was sort of on the corner, not where we thought. We thought it was literally, would be inside, but we couldn't find it. Uh, so we drove around a bit and then eventually found it. Um, so we're just in the middle of unpacking everything at the moment. Um, we have been in this, well, we've not been in this one. Chris's parents have been in this one before. So it was just trying to remember whereabouts it was, but we could not remember from memory in all honesty. So yeah, now it's time to all unpack everything. And then like I say, we've got a Tesco order coming later on tonight. Ignore the hair. It's been hot in that car. It's been a long journey. Um, Holly's ate her food, no problem. So there's no issues there. Um, Cause last time she came down, she's a bit fussy with her food, but she's already, set already well. settled in. Oh my God, look, my head. I, I, I don't call me a midget now. I'm almost talking, touching the ceiling. <laughs> <laughs> Just show you the garden one second. So that's the new conservatory bit. I can't remember. Oh, they've got board games, really. Yeah, they've got board games after we bought board games and everything else. Yeah, I did remember we played games last time, but I couldn't remember if your mum had brought them or. Played. Got us loads. Um, who's after when we go because Holly Monks. <laughs> yeah. And then right got this picnic table outside with all these stones down. Um, that's to get back into the kitchen way and then we've got a few steps here into this like little nice garden area with a load of bushes surrounding it. Oh look there's a little rub in there. Been a long journey for her. It has. <laughs> come here. Holly, come here. Good girl. Oof. Mm. You can see the tiredness in her eyes. <laughs> um, so yeah, we're going to have a night in tonight, especially because Tesco's coming anyway for delivery. So we've got to be here for that. Um, don't know what we're having for dinner later. I Figure something out when Tesco gets here. Yeah. Probably be a late dinner. I'm actually quite hungry now, still. Oh. You've got snacks? <laughs> I have got snacks. Me and your rings are off. And some alcohol at the same time. What? <laughs> <laughs> so this is everything downstairs. Um, they've got a little... Did you say walk here? That's to put your lead because we basically want you to go in and out from the back. Um, I don't know if uh, you saw well, that, yeah. No, I don't. Uh, yeah, do you know the back gate bit as well? Yeah. Um, so obviously that way leads into the conservatory area that we've just shown you. Is that right there? Yeah. Oh, there's one there. Yeah. Not very bright. I do remember this room being quite dark. <laughs> yeah, it's um, quite an old building. Yeah, it's very not a very old like cottage basically, and it's got this log log burner here. You're making use of. Um, you're definitely making use of that 32 inch screen tv nice sofas here with a little coffee table chris do you want to do a quick tour usually it's me sure let's go <laughs> so, nice then you've got the dining table with like a bench there some of my stuff already on it yeah you stay there holes stairs leading up Ooh, i've never actually been upstairs in one no or oh, other than to the toilet yeah. Because there's only a toilet upstairs. Right. I think there this should is be the a main double room and a king size. Okay. Oh god, there's a step there as well. Right, in this place you've oh, got to yeah. watch out for your steps. Yeah, <laughs> tripping on the one coming into the cottage. Well, this is a nice big room, a nice isn't it? Big wardrobe here, plenty of space. Are you sure you've got a lot of shirts? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Oh, feels like a comfy bed actually. I love the little like bits around it as well, and like All the, the features, ones. like the fact that this wall's tilting and stuff like that. Like oh, you probably can't see it in there. Features they've got like all the little beach photos, the fish there, um, the seaside curtains. Yeah, towels come included as well. Right, shall we go into the next one? I like those bottles on that window. Oh yeah, <laughs> quite cool. <laughs> 
have to say and watch after the same step. <laughs> Don't break your ankle, Chris. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, this is a big room, isn't it? It is. Lovely. Two bedroom. Um, Got a hanger over here for your dressing nice. gowns and whatnot. Towels. Wow, this is a nice step. Oh, I need to use that mirror. That's that's that. Oh, this floor tilts as well. Even better. Even bigger wardrobe. Wow, this is this is nice. It's built in. It's a walk-in one. Yeah. We oh, yeah. This is where your travel cot and stuff is kept, yeah. isn't it? If you've got kids. And. Well, I think that's got. Spare oh look, little kid hangers as well. <laughs> we won't need dogs like that yet. <laughs> we could do it with a wardrobe like this in our main room though. Yeah, we'll go with him one. Um, features. Just show you. I've got to feel like I'm drunk in this house. The way the floor's like, <laughs> in. it's like um, Kate's hen all over again. This floor is like, ooh. <laughs> on buildings. Yeah. Oh yeah, coat hooks there. <laughs> Minor step. I, I have seen the bath on this. Oh yeah, big step. Mm. This room's locked, so I can only assume there's cleaning stuff in here. Maybe, yeah. This is where your thermostat and stuff is kept. Don't need to turn it off, actually quite a nice warm. Mm. Some more books when you're in the bath, look. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is... Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I'm getting in there. <laughs> <laughs> Ceiling's quite high compared to usual clutches in this one. Uh, you've got a walk-in shower as well. <laughs> oh, even better for you. <laughs> I don't know, I'm just going to be using razors. I haven't brought my shave. Oh, right, you haven't got your shave on. <laughs> Though I do need a shave, as you can probably see. Um, we'll show you out the front in a second as well. Like right the front of the house. Okay. Are you happy? Yeah. Very <laughs> happy with it. I know, cool. <laughs> Just need to learn to stop tripping over the steps. Yes. Especially um, ones like this, catch you off guard. Let's just... Holes, waiting for us. <laughs> Where, at the bottom? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, good girl. <laughs> So in the kitchen you get all these bits and bobs included, which I brought anyway because I wasn't sure, but you get sponge, dishcloth, washing up liquid, um, all your cooking bits and bobs in there, even more in there, oh no, I see glasses in there, um, your kettle, coffee tier, that's just our food bits. <laughs> um, in here was even more cooking bits and bobs, mugs, bowls, plates. Um, excuse me, do you have to investigate everything? Oh, I don't think she liked it. <laughs> More bits and bobs, ironing board, mop. Uh, this side, you've got your knives and forks and more knives and more knives. <laughs> Chopping board, spoons and tea towels, which I bought tea towels anyway, but <laughs> hey-ho. You never know with these kind of bottle opener. What's going to be around? Another knife. <laughs> <laughs> uh, more pans. <laughs> then you've got your freezer and your fridge in there. Microwave, bread bin, toaster. Let's not mention the toaster. <laughs> um, and the, even an extra bowl as well in there and a bin. The washing machine is outside, so I'll put my shoes on and then show you that in a second. You've got your oven there as well so yeah it's fairly small but like cozy small yeah <laughs> also a chair there <laughs> a big strange clock so we're gonna try and do the little tire that lost for safety <laughs> i think you get one lot of woods, in woods included or kindling included basically hello hogs hello <laughs> Yes, I know. I know, it's all interesting. <laughs> oh, 
while you do that i'm going to try and sort the wi-fi up <laughs> hey, me and chris are just having a gin this is one that i've still got from pn and cruise actually it's lasted me a while it's nearly a year yeah chris has got a lemon slice in his i don't like lemon so that's not happening and also some tonic cheers mm. cheers <laughs> mm. Mm. I'm just in the middle of reading this book. It's got everyone's comments and stuff in about the cottage and their reviews and stuff. I'll have a little read through. <laughs> Update on Holly. She is well and truly. No, bless her. She'll be wide awake again tomorrow morning, no doubt. <laughs> Nice little cosy area for it. <laughs> right, so I've just plugged Roku box into the TV. Um, there was like Netflix and Disney Plus already connected, but I don't know if that was someone else's account that they've forgotten to log out, so I don't want to use their account. I just might as well use my own. Um, Chris is still trying to get... Well, it was going. It just keeps going out. Have you opened like the air thing? Is there an air thing in there? Well, that's what apparently the air thing is. Oh. Don't know then. Website in Sanford Cottage. That's in the country. Yeah. Isn't there a sergeant's position here in London? No. Can I remain here as a PC? No. Do I have any choice? New. Sergeant, I kind of like it here. Right, so we've just been watching Hot Fuzz and the Tesco order has now arrived. Well, they sort of rang Chris because they've gone to the wrong location. Um, apparently it's sent him somewhere in the marina or something, but um, Chris just gave him directions and is on his way. So he knows, I think he's been here before, so he knows where he's going. Um, but for some reason, the sat nav just sent him into a different location or we just sent him the wrong address, I don't know. Um, but yeah, it's like, so it's only like £50 worth anyway of delivery. So yeah, oh, he's parked actually right outside right now, actually. Uh, look, we've not got loads to be fair, but it is a very tight lane actually, so. Some more heat. Ah yes, so the fan will blow to... It's all arrived. Not very shiverish your man, is he? <laughs> it's trying to put it all in bags. <laughs> got scalding. <laughs> That's probably good. I mean, I suggested to put it in the bags, didn't I? <laughs> I thought it would make it easier for ourselves. Yeah, pack it all in and then just shove it in here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <well. laughs> Alright, so we're gonna have some cheetah pasta bake mm. yeah. with some vegetables. Is that how you do it? That's how you can do it. Okay. No comment. <laughs> I'm still learning where everything is in this house. Cheese tucks, the cheese tucks. You gotta pay the cheese tucks. <laughs> Didn't even touch the sides. <laughs> Try and lick it off herself. None of it went on you holes. You swallowed it whole. <laughs> Doing your cheese. <laughs> no, come on, you're not having any more. In, in, take it. Good girl, lie down. Dinner is served. Yeah. Uh, yes, yes, be our guest. Good job. Service. I don't know what that is. Soup du jour. <laughs> Tuna pasta bake. Yum yum yum. Not at this rage, is it? Sure. No, no. Glad you added the tuna pasta sauce to the uh, the order. Tuna pasta sauce. Oh yeah, yeah. Doesn't remember she did it. <laughs> the pat the sasha you mean? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. It's now the next day. First night. I slept quite well, to be fair. The bed's quite comfy. 
Yep. Ah, the only thing that woke me up was the radiator going bleep, 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 bleep. <laughs> we get that at our house sometimes. Um, yeah, it's just there in the radiator. So now we're on our way down to Insto for the beach. Um, it's only about a 20 minute walk to get there. And then we're going to go into the John's shop. Is it called John's? John, yeah, I think it's just called John's. Yeah. Um, to get some more wooden stuff and just see what's in there. No, I might get one of those. Um, Things that your mum taking a coffee or something like that as well. I want one of those things that your mum showed me the other day. Oh, that <laughs> the ice cream. Yeah, the ice cream. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> I'm just more worried about if the dog's caught. So. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'll let her have a run first. Welcome. <laughs> Holly, good girl. Yeah. <laughs> Come on. Yeah. 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 Steady. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. <laughs> Hello, So we've just finished up at the beach, then went into John's. We got a cappuccino and chocolate brownie, chocolate brownie. and cream egg. Mm. <laughs> Ooh. That chocolate brownie. Right, so we're currently figuring out the rules for who wants to be a millionaire. Sitting outside enjoying the view. Right, Chris won at Monopoly for once. Um, probably on about the fourth beer right now. <laughs> Are we? Yeah, fourth beer. Oh, yeah. Can't take my head a bit, but that's because the sun's been out and I'm a bit dehydrated. But who cares? It's we're on a holiday. Uh, <laughs> so we're just about to have a well. We're just about to put the Sunday roast in for dinner. Um, now the sun's gone in. It's a bit cooler. Holly's settled in really well here um, because last time we came down, she was a bit fussy with her food and stuff. But this time she's, you know, pretty much ate it straight away. So no problems there with her food. Um, tomorrow we're going to take a walk or a drive down to Westwood Ho and probably visit, uh, well, it's bank holiday Monday. So probably, hopefully the chippy's open or something. We'll get a bite to eat there. The chippy's really nice. They do a really nice curry sauce. For those of you who like curry sauce and mush peas with your chips and stuff. So we'll probably go there and... Um, not going to change for the amusement, but we might go in. We'll see what's open tomorrow, I guess, it's bank holiday. <laughs> <laughs> He's judging me! <laughs> then carry on. How are the knives? Oh, not too bad, to be fair. Hello everyone, I can't remember the last bit I recorded, I think it was still outside or something, but as you can tell I've burnt my nose, Chris has burnt his back. Um, today we have gone into Barnstable to do a bit of shopping, just to see what's around. Um, so we've just found a car park, so Chris has gone to pay for the parking. And then yeah, we're going to look around all the shops to see what there is. Right, so we're now at Westwood Ho, Chris has gone to get a ticket. Um, so there's arcades and like a really nice um, restaurant here uh, called Morin's or Morin's or something like that. I don't know really how to say it, but yeah, might go into there and also the amusement park. We 
now sitting down. Chris has got the log fire going, watching Rebels. And he's made some nachos, guacamole and some sour cream. Yummy. Also, he's got a glass of red wine and I've got basically no gin left. <laughs> Time to eat the Willy Wonka chocolate bar. Will there be a golden ticket? No. Oh, there might be actually. So earlier we went to the fishmonger in, was it Appledore? Just outside of Appledore. Just outside of Appledore. So we got some six scallops, three prawns, two fillets of cod. Yep, that was it. That was it, yeah, that's all £15. So I'll show you that in a bit when we get out of the fridge. But Chris is now preparing dinner. So we're doing some onions. Some spring onions as well. With spring onions. Um, We've got peas in the freezer and spinach in the fridge. Peas, spinach, dough, whatever potatoes you said. Uh, Leonese potatoes is what I'm going to do. Leonese potatoes. Which is basically just onion potato. But yeah, the fishmonger's name is... Devon and Cornwall. I can't remember what it's called. Now. I'll put it on the screen for all you guys now. Um, yeah. If you don't like fish, then obviously don't go because it absolutely reeks of fish. But they have got a very good selection. Yeah, uh, they have got a very good selection. Yeah, I mean, I only like certain fish, but I, you know. There's prawns, scallops, brill, mussels. Uh, John, salt, John, paste, John, John Dory. Dory. <laughs> I think they had some turbot there. Brill, I don't know. A lot of it, that. I didn't even. Skate wings. Lemon no, ray wings. May wings, yeah. Whatever all that is. <laughs> uh, yeah, they had a lot. Now to open the wine. Just getting the fish out of the bag. Two cobs. Towel in a second to get, dry all of these off. What? Still with the row on. I like the room. I like the room. A lot of restaurants don't like serving it though. And prawns. I'm going to take the heads off of these. Hey, it's um, Bill and Will. Wait, Will? Will? Somebody? I've lost my Will! Happy feet. <laughs> off, like that's. That's not off. It's got a stronger smell than the scallops do. Yeah. So apparently, if it smells fishy, it's gone off. It's got near the end of its life, it's only slightly, but. I yeah. mean, some fish is fishier than it is anyway, isn't it? Yeah, monkfish is one of them, it's quite a fishy smell. So, yeah, that's like fishier strong than. Strong smell, even. Scallops, you basically can't smell them, actually. I've just sniffed them up close. <laughs> Get a seasoning. I would use white pepper if I had it, but I didn't think to pack that. Where's the salt gone? There's a problem when you don't know the kitchen you're in, don't know where everything is. Even though I, well I didn't pack it all, should have just been at the place where I put it. <laughs> Salt's one of the things I forgot to bring down. Right, how are these taters doing? Taters freshest. That's taters freshest. That's taters. I think there, Davis. I prefer using the towel, those silicon rugs are fiddly. Back in there, guys. Boom. Inside down, away from you, so it doesn't spit at your hands. See, I know that. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Watching Gordon Ramsay, that is. <laughs> Yeah. 
So in this tray it's got some lemon, spinach. It's not spinach, it's fat, basil. I'm just using tell of what we've got as a uh, something to put them. Oh. Yeah. On top of them. Okay, <laughs> lemon, basil. Celery. Celery. <laughs> So Chris has just shouted me back, he's currently starting the sauce. You do know you can pick up the camera, you know. I'm focusing on not burning the pan. I know, I'm just asking, I'm just saying for future reference. Oh, I don't know the pink coat your phone. I forget. I'll see if I can add your face to it. I don't know if you can add more than one face. Or I'll set the pin code to your phone pin so then you'll know. <laughs> Fair enough. That'll work. So, gone in here. We've diced up some spring onion and some celery. Spring but, onion and celery. But you can just use onion if you want, just sweating this down a bit. What's that? Garlic and... This is garlic, that's just a bit of the top end of spring onion that I'm going to throw out on at the end as a bit of a garnish. Because mm. we don't have any herbs. <laughs> There's some residue, because I didn't use a non-stick pan. There's some residue of the fish on this pan. That's right, a bit of extra flavour. Exactly. I'll be getting scolded right now by the chef. Well, you're not in a restaurant. My restaurant. You're cooking for a Me. local. <laughs> My poor white wine. <laughs> We've got more at home, it's alright. That's at home though. <laughs> yeah, Prosecco, it's alright. help these pans because oh. they have metal bloody handles. <laughs> Anyone else what, sorry? I hate pans that have metal handles. I mean, they're not the best. Because I always they're go and go, ah! <laughs> You've got the pan over the f***ing flame! Today we got these from um, Westwood Home. Went into a little gift shop. If I can get open, we got a tag. It's a shame it weren't brown and white. <laughs> uh, it says coriander. Then we got fridge magnet, which has to be done every time we go down somewhere. We always have to get a fridge magnet. That's not the fridge magnet. That's oh, the keychain. That's the keychain. <laughs> That's the, the keychain. Mm, that's the keychain. That's the fridge magnet. <laughs> ah, um, Westwood Ho. So, yeah. Every time we go somewhere, we always add to our collection. Um, not by price. I think it's like two, like one fifty each, basically, something like that. So, yeah. Chris's, I did cream. Yeah. And a bit of lemon juice. So it's now white 
cream sauce ish thing. <laughs> Good description. Thank you. Round of applause for me. Chris is demanding that I come and record him. Demanding? Yeah. Demanding? That's pretty much what you said. Yeah. <laughs> you said that. Right, you're going to come record. Nice. Nice. No. Season, season, season. A non stick pan. A non stick pan. Scallops are in. Just that. 30 seconds each side. <laughs> See, I know my scallops. <laughs> Out the pan in one go! <laughs> How long the prawn steak? Uh, depends how big they are, but probably no more than a minute. And we are cooking them on a that sauté in them. This sauce will probably only take about a minute, minute and a half. Oh, you're not going to do your little. Mm -hmm. Not enough really to do that. <laughs> A lot of pans have been used in the making of this film. <laughs> See how well this comes out. I normally make them too liquid. Tasty, but too liquid normally. Now, do I have a spatula? I think the answer's going to be no. What do you call a spatula? Is there one of these things? <laughs> yes. <laughs> I never saw them. <laughs> They've been there the whole time, dearest. <laughs> Apparently I've not. smart decision of me. It's a good job I've got asbestos hands. Oh yeah, because it's just come out of the oven, ain't it? Yes. <laughs> oh, Luckily the oven's turned off and it's only warm and it's not super hot. I've probably also done enough food here for like, three people. Two very hungry. And a dog. <laughs> Next, the cod. Yeah. And we are on our way 
today to Taperley Gardens. We've not been here before and it's also dog friendly, so that's a bonus. It's also not far from where we're staying. Yeah. I don't know why we've never been here before in all the times we've been there. Have your parents been before? I don't think that, I don't know. I don't think they have. Maybe. 7.50 to get in. Um, so when we got back from the garden place, we then just chilled out in the sun, had a beer, and now we're on our way to a place called Flame Factory, which do pizzas, burgers, steak, and sharing platters, like and, platters stuff like and like salads and stuff like that. Um, so it'll be really nice. So do our do do our colour. Yeah. Yeah. Alcohol there as well. So we might grab a drink, come around. <laughs> um, we've not actually been into Appledore yet. Uh, that's where it is. The place is in Appledore. if anything's changed when we go down there. Probably not. Yeah, probably not. <laughs> Morning everyone. Today is our last day at Insto. Well, we go home today, probably after breakfast. Um, typical, the first, well, pretty much the second day of summer we've had, but it's the best day of summer we've had. We're going home again. Yeah. Um, so just like walking Holly on the beach for the last time, and then we're going to maybe grab some breakfast at the Insto Arms. Um, it's lovely today. <sighs> bit of water for her down here. Yeah, let's see if she swims in it. <laughs> I'll put the frisbee away for a minute. <laughs> Even this looks nice for me to go in. <laughs> yeah. Better you drink this water than the sea. So we're now we're in stars and I've ordered a cappuccino, Chris has ordered a cappuccino. I've gone for the American pancakes. What are you going for? Smoked salmon bagel. Oh, he's being a good girl. Oh, he looks quite good. It's a shame we don't like salmon. <laughs> Holly wants it. <laughs> Holly does want it. But we are in the car heading home. Holly's in the back there, all packed up as well. Probably just about to see her head. Um, but yeah, it's been really good down here. So we're only here for a week, but we've got quite a bit done, I suppose. Uh, nothing's really changed down here. We're in, the, in the boat house, they've got new seating and stuff outside. Um, and they've taken the cushions away as well. So I don't know if they've just been wrecked or what, but um, that is pretty much the end of the vlog um if you've enjoyed give me a thumbs up and i'll see you in the next video goodbye